audio jungle. Uh, hi guys, welcome to Football Brownie. Hope you're well, keeping safe, keeping each other safe and spreading a love during this pandemic. Because we all need a little bit of loving, guys. We all need a little bit of loving. Now, before I go any further, please like, share, most importantly, subscribe to the channel. Remember, subscription is free. So hit that subscribe button right now. And sorry for the burp. <laughs> if you heard that. Okay. Uh, Cardiff City. Um, unfortunately... One of the best uh, players, uh, you know, in the Cardiff team uh, this year has now been recalled by Lo uh, by Wolves from his loan spell at the club. Uh, first of all, I'd like to say uh, thank you for uh, your effort, Ryan, uh, Ryan Giles. Um, you know, some, some of the, uh, the crosses you put on for the likes of Kiefer Moore and so on. Uh, without you, I'll be completely honest with you, we probably would have less points than what Derby have at the moment. Um, all the very best for your career. Um, I do hope that uh, you're given a chance in the Premier League because, quite frankly, you deserve it. However, the pressure really now is on for Cardiff. Many occasions, Ryan Giles was our only creative, a creative player. So... We've got no creativity at all. Uh, Ryan Wintle uh, has also been recalled from his loan spell at Blackpool. He's not a, a, a like for like. He would help out in the middle of a park. Which, boy, don't we need help there. But the pressure really is on the Cardiff City board and Steve Morrison now. Because relegation... It's staring us in the face. Let's not let's not uh, be deluded with that. And if we don't get a suitable replacement for Ryan Giles, a proper winger, a proper old-fashioned, you know, a lot of wing play, you know, we could be in serious trouble. Anyway, what do you think, uh, fellow Cardiff City fans? Please uh, uh, comment below. Um, and let's hope, let's keep our fingers crossed for a good January transfer window. Although, with these idiots in charge, <laughs> I, I, I think I'm dreaming by even suggesting we could have a good January transfer window. Okay, take care, guys. Bye-bye.